Welcome to Shelly's Cuisine. Today, we're gonna make lasagna soup. That's right, and it's pretty simple to make, and I'm just gonna tell you what the ingredients are. The ingredients are five hot Italian sausage I cooked in my air fryer. You could do it on the stove or you can do it in the oven before you get ready. I have five garlic cloves chopped fine. Of course, I have some fresh basil, and right now I only got pur purple basil, so that's what I'm throwing in. And I have half a cup of onion, one and a half cup of carrots, and I'm using bow tie pasta, Mafalda pasta, you can use that as well, two cups of mushrooms, and two cups of fresh spinach, and we have one can of Hunt's tomato sauce and a can of stewed tomatoes. Please try to make sure that you get the Italian recipe version of the stewed tomatoes so it has some seasonings in it. And we're gonna just use a little bit of oil to get it going. And then there are a few ingredients we'll add later and I'll let you know what they are. So we're gonna put about eh, maybe a teaspoon of olive oil. And we want to put our onions in. I had my fire too high. We're going to put the garlic in. Onions, garlic. Just sweat that a little bit. Then we're going to put our sausage in. And I just want to make sure that, you know, the onions sweat a little bit. Okay, then we're going to come with our carrots and we're just going to mix that up with our onions and sausages. It's going to be good. Okay, and we are going to come with our tomato sauce. Our stewed tomatoes stir that up you know I forgot the chicken broth I'll be right back okay so I forgot the chicken broth here it is four cups of chicken broth I had it ready but I didn't have it with me. So, I'm mixing this up. Now I'm gonna put my basil in for flavor. So my soup is going, and I will be putting the mushrooms and the pasta in later with the spinach. So I just want to see what my taste is so far. Oh, that's good. So, I'm gonna put a little black pepper. And it doesn't need much oil, because I, um, salt, I'm sorry, because I have the chicken broth. So, that's it. I am going to let this simmer on the stove. Look into the pot. Our soup is getting nice and thick, and our carrots are almost done. So, it's at this time we are going to add our pasta. Only a cup. That's going to make the soup a little bit thicker, but we're, you know. And there are our mushrooms. So, we will let this cook until our pasta is cooked and our mushrooms and then we will throw in the spinach almost at the end okay you can really see our soup is almost ready just have to have the pasta a little bit more so 
at this point we put our spinach in and we put our spinach in and when the spinach wil wilts nothing like fresh spinach then our soup will be ready so this is lasagna soup and we still have another ingredient that you didn't expect coming up so our lasagna soup is ready and this is the extra twist that comes on the lasagna soup you're going to put fresh mozzarella okay so normally um you would cut up about one cup worth of uh mozzarella tr ch chunks and you would put it in each bowl and then you bring the soup look at that wow you've got sausage that just looks absolutely delicious and guess what when that mozzarella melts it's absolutely delicious so let's get that mozzarella going so of course you want to put this in when it's piping hot so that your mozzarella can melt now i'm gonna taste i want a piece of mozzarella so That's really delicious, especially with the mozzarella. I was a little impatient, so I ate it before the mozzarella melted, but you make this at home and you will have the chance to have your mozzarella melt. And so, thank you for visiting Shelly's Cuisine and for making lasagna soup with us today. Please subscribe and hit the notification button Please visit our website, www.shellyscuisine.com and tune in next week to find out what we will twist next.